Hey guys and welcome back to The Way, the puzzling platform adventure where I am trying to save my already dead wife from the spectre of death that she is hiding out in. And we have just solved this water, water flow puzzle here. Uh, it was relatively easy, we had to go and do some design, uh, some control inputs at the bottom right of the map. Uh, and that's let water flow. Now we've got this guy to worry about and I'm not sure exactly what he does. Can I climb up these platforms? Are they tin can only? They are tin can only platforms. Let's try the shield. I think the shield might be a thing here. Can we? Oh no wait, no no. He's a, he's a grenade guy, isn't he? I remember this guy was the person. Oh no! I remember that guy was the person we could mess with. Not not this one at the end. Okay, so let's try getting down and underneath this guy here. Okay, sorry about that. My doorbell went off. It was a few package deliveries. So down here, we are just underneath Explodey Grenade Guy up there. Uh, we have some platforms we can stand on. There appears to be some other things we can do here as well. If we get the, the old telekinesis powers out. So this is the water that was flowing from the last puzzle. Let's just kind of take a step or two over this way. Can't trigger it whilst I'm on the platform on the uh, the ladder let's try doing some stuff here okay so that redirects the water flow um that goes up and across let's let's try that you know because it's it's changing stuff it was coming through the middle to begin with so let, let's try going through the top let's uh, shunt that up as well does that no just just there does that work it kind of works we're going across the top hey what what are you Got a little little platformy thing there. Let's try firing the panel. Oh, oh, okay. So that opens and closes the bottom of that. Is is that repeatable? Yes, that is repeatable. Can I do stuff while it's doing stuff? No, I cannot. Okay, that's fine. Let's get our telekinesis back out and see what else we can do with this. So we've got the water coming in from the top. It kind of meets an end point there. We need to give it a turn of some description. We can't do that okay so obviously i don't know let's let's try this last one back here being oh i didn't hit my jump button it's uh, a little bit annoying that i can't get up that ladder behind oh he fired it well over the top of me there that was that was good uh, it's a little bit annoying that i can't get up to that ladder over there we'll have to see if there's something we can do about that at some point okay so let's leave it going forwards and straight this time let's oh. Okay, I'm going to try something else. We're going to set some teleportations up here because I really want to get behind this guy and see what's going on back there. So when he walks forwards, I'm going to set a teleport point. Oh, oh, maybe not. I really thought that was going to be a winner there. We'll try to be a little bit more cautious about this, but if that doesn't work a second time, we'll assume that there has to be another way of doing it. Yeah, no, he's going to turn around now, isn't he? Yeah, okay, so let's let him do his little patrol route out. Tin can, totally not bothered. Let's set that and run away. Now, when he turns around and walks past it... Oh, okay, all right, so that's that's not a thing. I really thought that was going to be the way to solve, not the puzzle, but that particular issue. Okay, so let's go back down. Hey, dude, do you, do you mind just getting out of my way? Let's go back down and figure out what's going on with this. So let's go see what's at the other end. Where are we trying to get the water to go to? This this is an important question right now. This is a most important question. We, we can see where it wants to go past. Oh, this hellish, nightmarish jumping puzzle. Why would you put a precise input challenge into a game like this? Why, why would that happen? Is it not enough that we're already solving puzzles? Okay, so we've got two water lines here. One that comes this way and one that comes that way. Uh, I can't really see what anything does. So let's try and go for the top one. Let's, let's backtrack. No. Let's backtrack the, the route here and see what we can do. So this one's going to go straight. I mean, we could give it a little oh no we can't i was going to say we could give it a little um zigzag down with using this piece at the bottom so you can see that the, the movable pieces are these three ones here this this up bend straight across and down bend uh, unfortunately i can't give it an up bend so we're going to have to go with this straight piece here okay now if we can jump away across without killing ourselves yeah that kind of works okay now where were we coming from i've lost my mouse again has it really run away there we go uh so we're coming in along this route here now we want to use this one to go up oh oh 
Oh, do we want to go straight there, or can we? I mean, what happens if we turn up? No, that's a dead end, if you will. So going straight must backtrack round, down, and across this second from bottom, penultimate from bottom, however you wish to describe it. Okay, how are we going to get it into there? Actually, full on, don't know. We're going to have to try and figure a few things out, though. Um, that one, right? Oh, what did I do? I obviously had done something already. So we've got water spilling out. What is that? What was that? So we're going to have a look. I'm not sure what it is we need to do. This this little bucket dumpster thing above me. Got to have something to do with it, right? Got to. Uh, so we've done that one? Do, like something moved. There is, there is a thing in place now. So do we now think about... I don't know, maybe doing this bottom one. Yeah, because it, it's rolled this out and turning the water off hasn't taken it back. So let's see what we can do about that. Straight line doesn't look like the winner there, does it? Let's let's try this. Yeah, okay, so it gives us a little, little dog leg, if you will. So we need to try and get this one here. Third from bottom. Third from... If I die now, I'm not going to be a happy bunny. Third from bottom. Um... So, oh, this should be, oh, that's a straight. Can we, a second from bottom. Hmm. Okay, so that's not quite right. Let's let's put it there and see if we can go change another one. Hey, do you mind? I really would like you just to. Okay, so straight across at this point. Straight across. If we could just, oh. Oh, look, 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 the bucket thing's moving. What, what does this do? Quick, keep up with it, keep up with it. I know I'm probably going to die if I do it like this, but... No. No, that's not... Oh. Okay, I thought that was going to interact with that somehow. Oh, no! I thought that was going to interact with that somehow. So let's see if we can't get on this ladder. Little little jumping grab there. That was that was super nice. Uh, oh, look, we can get around this guy. No, 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 why are you coming this way? You're not supposed to come this way now. Is he, like, full on after me? He didn't come this far beforehand. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed. If I could just... There we go. Uh, he just doesn't care about me, does he? He doesn't care. He thought he's got a preset program to follow, and he is going to follow it to the best of his ability. Have we just activated all these droids? Is there a way of telling the laser droids apart from the grenade droids? This is a problem I need to figure out. Okay, so these guys down here, look. So you see the guy at the bottom? He's got a red face, and these are all green faces. So I'm going to assume that I can use my shield. This might be a bad assumption. Aha! <laughs> oh, oh, hey! Um, uh, <laughs> that, that didn't at all feel like hacks. Okay, let's just... Move! Okay, that took a, a little second of concentration there, but hopefully now everyone's kind of the same. I keep doing some weird voodoo hacks here. I, I don't know if you guys keep noticing that, but I sure do. Uh, let's try going up. I feel like Tin Can should be here, because look, look at all these ledges and stuff. Uh, okay, how are we going to... Oh, are these just on similar timers? Is there a break at any point? There doesn't appear to be a break at any point. Uh, I could probably get up now and fire across, but once again, that feels ultimately hacks. But I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to do it anyway. Okay, we're going to put that there. I'm going to come up and do this. Oh, come on, before the shield runs out. That's nice. Okay, let's let our shield recharge. Was it just the three? Is there a fourth as well? Looks to be just the three. Oh, there is a fourth coming, but I've got some shield charge, so this should be all good. If you could, please just finish the job for me. I, it feels like I'm doing this uh, pretty hacksy. There's a cool tin can section. That's good. We'll, we'll go with that. Tin can is too far away. How do we get him up here? How do we get him up here? That, see, that to me screams that we've done it wrong. That guy's got a shield as well. Hmm. Okay. What's that guy about? What do you reckon he does? I'm not sure. He looks like someone who could help me. So I'm feeling that because we've got the other guy down below, Tin Can can't get up and past. And I don't actually know how to solve this guy. Right, I'm going to try running jump. Just about made it. This rock, what does this rock do? Oh, we can push the rock. Can we pull the rock? 
I can, but it doesn't go where I want it to go. Also, the uh, the water seems to have stopped flowing. Uh, can I have that rock again, please? Have I broken it? I feel like I might have broken it. Okay, no, this is good. Um, so, like, I can push this, right? Bet it's got to go into that hopper, though. I put a lot of money on it going onto that hopper. So let's try and make this jump back. And now try and figure out how to get that hopper into the right place. Yeah, look, ooh, things are different. Things are different. Let's go and have a look. Ah. So we're up at the rocks still. That's good. That's good. I really do hate these jumping. Well, I don't hate these jumping games. I quite, quite enjoy these jumping games. I just wish I was a little bit better at them so I could be ah, not having to change all the time. So this all still works. Okay, so how do we get the rock into that machine over there? Let's let's try a little telekinesis again and see if we can do something like reinvigorate this. Yeah, I thought we could. I thought we could. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's try and jump all the way back. Oh, that was a scary jump. Scary, scary, scary jump. Um, maybe should have set a teleport power point. That would have been useful. Ah. Um, now that I think about it, I probably actually wanted to be down at the puzzle piece so I could push this when I liked. Ah! Oh, that was close. That was close. Not, not quite what we were trying to do. That was not the way of doing that either. So what's going to happen? I'm going to put the rock in there. It's going to fall? I don't know. I don't know. Can we climb on top of this? We can climb on top of this. Look, this guy's got a laser gun. This is, this is the guy we saw from the other side. So we've gone around and saved, uh, done a lot of things to set up for this, but still not quite got this one right. Okay, so this time I've set it up so I can literally just walk over to the rock and hopefully just push it straight into that thing. Uh, then I need to kind of go around and maybe get this flowing again? Uh, what do you guys reckon? Do we, do we get this, this shuttling back and forth? Uh, maybe, maybe. Let, let's go over and see. Because the problem is, I don't know where I want to send it. This is the main problem. I assume I want to put it over here somewhere, because that's the, the furthest point. Let's pull this back down. Uh, was this the right one? It was not. It was the next one up, of course, because it needed a little dog leg. Okay, so that's all of them going again. Now, this has gone all the way over to the other side. Do you reckon I've got to stop it? this far over because look there's there's a few things here that I could even jump up and get on oh no I can't jump up and get on they are literally a wall so I assume that this is the one where I'm gonna wanna gonna stop it right here right I hope I think maybe we'll try it we're gonna put it all the way over and then just drop the rock out the bottom of it okay so that's as far over as I can put it let's try and oh, not kill ourselves let's grab onto that let that ladder by far the safest maneuver in the game is just grabbing a ladder okay and we're going to try this panel and see what happens something happened i don't think that was what i wanted to happen no I, in fact i just realized what i was supposed to do i was kind of seeing if i could drop it onto the um nothing happens of course nothing happens the bounty hunter's ship but that's not what i need to do oh no 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 i need to drop it put it all the way up there. Uh, I need to drop it onto the Ed 209 thingy down the bottom, right? Okay, so I've got the rock and the hopper back in place. Let's try and make our way back up here so we can push that rock in. And then we've got to think about where we're going to try and strike the Ed 209 type character from. Uh, I assume from the top would be a good choice here. So we push that in. Ooh. I'm glad we could stand on that. Now, I want, what I want to do is try and move it over towards that panel, right? Because that's where the Ed 209 bot would be standing underneath me. I assume that he's been following me around the entire time. Okay, so thankfully it saved us right, right where we want to be. Oh man, could you imagine if it hadn't have saved us here? I, I would have gone, uh, not literally spare, but I would have not been the happiest of bunnies. Now, what's this set up for though? It doesn't appear to be set up for the maneuver I want to undertake. Can I do this from here? We can. So that's up there. We need to come over this way uh, once again, following the routes through. Okay, we can stop this right here, I think would be the best place for it. Would be nice to see. Yeah, I mean, we'll try that. It feels like he's going to try and get me, but 
Let's see what happens. If we've got to do it somewhere else, I mean, the only thing I can think of is we'd have to do it directly over our head, and that's scary. Missed him. It must be directly over our head. How far away can I activate the panel from? Like, all the way over here? Okay. Okay, so we have a new rock in the hopper, which should hopefully be coming its way over to me right now. Um, it might even have to go back first. So we're just going to stand here and wait. I'm wondering if there's anything else we could do, but that is that over the top of the rock. Uh, did I even go and push the rock in? Let's go, let's go and have a look, make sure. No, I didn't. I am a fool. Okay, so let's try and do that quick. Turns out killing yourself was a better idea there. Uh, let's just let that back up. Got to just wait a little bit longer. Um here brilliant thanks good job let's go over and try and capture that uh, ladder C captured the ladder let's go and get the rock now okay that's the rock in place let's try and get over to this panel before things get too hairy uh, so like somewhere like here oh it's going the other way because i started and stopped it again but like the ed 209 creatures right there i literally cannot think of anywhere else to do it um, yeah, because we can't activate the panel whilst trying to get him to walk either. So we're just going to kind of have to hope on this one. Uh, the panel is above my head. Or the rock is above my head. Sorry, let's do it. Got him! Woo! Okay, that is what we needed to do there. Now let's go and see what is, uh, what's the spoils from that particular puzzle. I, I don't actually know. We're going to go and have a look. It looks like just the ability to walk around. Oh, hey, what, what was that? power core slot let's see what we can do with that open her up and uh, get an unstable core we're gonna push this down to the broken pillar i think because we have seen that broken pillar yes you guys remember it i definitely do remember it, it is down and underneath this guy uh i was sure that there was oh no it's such a long way so i want to try and push that no no so i want to try and push that off the edge and then go back to one of the other underground bits. I would have thought it would have been a little bit easier to just push it off the edge. Uh, it, it turns out that I can... Well, it wouldn't fall until I stopped holding it, I think. That might be the thing. Uh, let's just try going all the way over and see what happens. Okay, it looks like it's off the edge. Let's let go. There we go. It went all the way down. This, this is good. This is great. This is all all the good words uh, i'm gonna try and see if we that that was not very nice guys that was not very nice at all i bet you all laughed or at least like groaned inwardly and i was like that was just less than a body height less than a body height well it turns out we're not allowed to do any of these things in less than triple actions but if i don't do if i don't repeat this process in triplicate my game just doesn't recognize that it happens it's not quite how it works, so the game just likes to try and kill me a lot. But I suppose that's okay. I suppose that's okay. Let's drop that guy down there. This this should be it. This really, really should be it. Unless I'm missing some, some valuable, valu valuable information, which I could very well be. I just want to kind of ease off the edge without killing myself, please. Okay, that's good. And then we should be able to make this drop here. <sighs> Over this way? No! Okay, here we are, back at the cliff of eternal damnation. Hopefully, I should just be able to wander off these edges. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and jump for that one. I don't, I don't feel... Well, I don't know. Do you reckon we can land on the ladder? Yes, we can land on the ladder. Ooh, wow, that was sketchy. That's what I should have done the first time. If I had just seen that ladder properly, then it would have been all good. Okay, hopefully somewhere over here, yes, holy book, god figure, etc. We should find the unstable power core. And a little bit further, we should be able to find... Yeah, you can see on the left there where the ground goes down and everything gets a little bit cracked, almost as if the sand has subsided underneath from this big supportive structure here. <laughs> Hopefully, yeah, doing that. Oh, no, completed. Use explosive to destroy the column. Great. Can I run away now, please? Thank you. I'm pre pressing the button. Oh, no, I am not in control here. Take my hands off the control pad and everything goes white. Boom, yucca. Took down your ship. My wife is safe now, at the price of someone else's life. Which, you know, is kind of how you protect your wife, generally. That's what I hear, anyway. It's what the movies have told me. Well, well, 
Here we go, old tin can. My ship can still power the capsule. That's the important bit. But it will never fly again. Ah. It means I have to leave her here. Alone. Well, you know, tin can. I still have this to travel with, but where does this come from? Finding the hidden city will take forever now. Forever. Still. Still. I won't give up. I'll be back for you. Ah, oh, this guy. He's so committed. E even after she dies. The, pa the pain of loss must be strong. Must be strong. Okay, so we put the speeder bike down. I see a panel. Can I use? At last, after all those years. I'm sure this is the right place. Two moons, button to press. How could this not? But. But. Where is the hidden city? It's hidden. Where is the Pyramid of Eternity? It's eternal. Achievement unlocked. Achievement in a... Uh, you guys can't see that. Needle in a haystack. Okay, we've pressed a button. Uh, some sort of cloaking device. Mm-mm-mm. Sure it's not a clocking device. Ah. Powered by three remote generators. But it seems I need to turn them off to proceed. Ah, oh, another triplet of puzzles. At least I can track the locations from here. Yeah. Awesome. Sigh. More travel. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this puzzling platformer adventure. I will see you guys next time where we're going to find out where these three generators are, how we're going to dismantle them, and hopefully do most of it in one episode. So I'll see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!